Welcome to my channel Solve Maths with Ease. In this question, we have an equilateral triangle with each side as 12 cm and a circle is inscribed in this equilateral triangle with each side of this equilateral triangle touching the circumference of this circle. So we need to find the radius of this inscribed circle without and with use of trigonometry. Pause the video if you want to give it a try. Continue watching the video for the solution. So first we will find the radius of the circle without using trigonometry. So we will start with joining point A with point B, point B with point Q and point C with point R. So here we have the modified figure. So as this is an equilateral triangle, so as per symmetry, all these three lines BQ, CR and AP will pass through the center of the circle O. Now it is given that AB is equal to BC is equal to AC is equal to 12 cm. And we have O as the in center and OP is equal to OQ is equal to OR which is the radius of the circle. Now from the given figure, we have area of this triangle ABC will be equal to the sum of the three uh, triangle areas which is OAB, OBC and OCA. Now area of the equilateral triangle ABC is equal to root 3 by 4 into its side square. And area of the other three triangles, we will use the formula half into base into height. So we have uh, put the uh, values. So for triangle OAB, the height will be OR and the base will be AB. For triangle OBC, the height will be OP and base will be BC. And for triangle OCA, the height will be OQ and base will be AC. So substituting the values, the side of the triangle is 12 and AB equal to BC is equal to AC is also equal to 12. So further solving this equation we get root 3 by 4 into 12 square is equal to 3 of half of 12 into radius so r is equal to 36 root 3 divided by 18. So we get the value of the radius of the circle as 2 root 3 centimeter. So we have found the radius of the circle without using trigonometry. Now we will find the radius of the circle using trigonometry. So as per trigonometry we know that the tan of any angle is equal to side opposite to angle A divided by side adjacent to angle A. So in right angle uh, triangle CPO, here we have this triangle, okay. The tan of angle OCP will be equal to OP upon PC. Now as per symmetry you can see this is equal to triangle. So this line CO will bisect equally bisect the angle PCQ and we know that this is an equilateral triangle so angle PCQ is 60 degree so angle OCP will be equal to 30 degree. So tan of 30 degree is equal to OP is equal to R and PC is equal to 6 because PC is half of BC so half of 12 is equal to 6. So tan 30 degree into 6 is equal to the radius of the circle. So further simplifying, we will put the value of 1030 is equal to 1 upon root 3 and we can write 6 as 2 into 3. So we get the radius of the circle as 2 root 3 centimeter. So we have found the radius of the circle using trigonometry as well. Thanks for watching the video. Please like the video and subscribe my channel for more interesting maths problems.